Reflected light is as the name suggests. It is light that is reflected onto the subject by the surface on which it is placed and the surfaces of the objects around it. Reflected light is affected by the distance, angle, and color. The shorter the distance of the surface reflecting the light, the more the influence of the reflected light. The steeper the angle of the reflecting surface, the stronger the light. The local value and color of the reflecting surface affects the reflected light in terms of brightness and color. Reflected light is weaker than direct light and is also diffused. The reflected light is often called bounced light or indirect light. It usually affects and is visible in the shadow family. It begins where the core shadow ends and ends where the ambient occlusion begins. For your assignment, you will draw a circle and shade it evenly with the 2 hedge pencil. Then using your kneaded eraser, you will pick out a highlight. You will then mark the center light area by putting a ring around it with a 2 hedge pencil. Then you will put the light form light, mid tones and dark form light using the 2 hedge and HB pencils respectively. The change in tonal value is subtle. You will then use the HB pencil to draw in the terminator or shadow line. You will then add the core shadow using the 2B pencil. Then you will shade the remaining part of the circle in the shadow using the HB pencil. This is the form shadow. Now in this form shadow area, you will use the kneaded eraser to draw in the reflected light. You will do this exercise every day. If you have got any value from this video, please give it a like and consider subscribing for more.